I make uh, all sorts of African drums. I also make red rock drums. And I build guitars just for a hobby, just for something different. And at the moment, we're sitting in Straw Studios, which is a straw bale uh, building designed specially for making noise and uh, enjoying music generally. And it's a place of inspiration. Uh, I've been building drums now, uh, Chico's in particular, for over 20 years, well over 20 years. Um, and that time I've built a lot of them. <laughs> a lot of them they've been through a lot of shops a lot of people have played them and enjoyed them and for the first time ever um, I'm offering uh, a workshop in building Ashikos uh, this is an Ashiko this one here is a furry Ashiko not you don't have to have furry of course you can have them with a clean skin as well this one here is New Guinea rosewood beautiful timber and it rings. So the combination of the skin and the wood make the, 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 the drum ring. The stave drums originated in Nigeria and, and of course back then they would have been uh, carved like you carve a, a djembe or a, an original dundun or whatever. Um, so they're carved out of a piece of wood so out of a single log. These are all stave construction. I don't know if you can see in there, but you might be able to see the facets inside. So these are stave. These are made up of a number of pieces of wood, glued together, um, put on the lathe, turned so they're nice and round, polished, and then the skins and the rings and skins are all put on. What I'm offering in these drum making workshops is the experience of building a complete Ashiko drum from scratch. So you'll experience the cutting. You won't actually get to cut, but you'll experience the cutting. Everything will be demonstrated to you. And if you want to go home and buy yourself a saw and cut it all yourself, that's fine. Um, not here, unfortunately. But every part of it will be demonstrated and or you will have hands-on in the process. So you'll see how they're cut. You'll understand the geometry of the, the way they're set up, um, how they're glued up, how they're polished, how the rings are made, um, the skins, you won't get to do the skins, you, don't, you won't want to do the skins, it stinks, it's a horrible process. I'll do the skins for you, right? I'll, I'll do that bit. And then we get to put all the roping, all the rope work, these fancy knots that run everywhere, I'll teach you how to do those, and we do the black ropes, and then we pull it all down, and it goes, <laughs> ding, bang. These workshops will be in for groups of five people only. Uh, I don't have the world's biggest workshop, so five people is all I can handle at any particular time. So in the workshops you'll you'll learn everything, and in some cases you might need, might need to help each other as well. You have a choice of three different timbers that you can use. This is the New Guinea rosewood. We can use tassie oak, which is a Australian native timber, or we've got some reclaimed jarra, which was somebody's front veranda which is very nice material. It does have some nail holes through it, but that's part of the character and we fill those anyway. Uh, so it's that makes a very nice drum too. So that's your three options. And then the other two options are is that you can either have furry or non-furry. So they look a bit more like this. So there's not much there except you don't get fur on the top. It's all shaved off, of course. There are a couple of processes that I can't allow students to do. One of them is cutting the staves on the panel saw. Uh, it's, it's a dangerous operation. It's not something for the faint-hearted. The other one is turning on the lathe. Unfortunately, um, this program was used in a school and a student actually had one blow up in the lathe. So I uh, decided from then on that I wouldn't allow anyone else to do it just for safety's sake. I will demonstrate all these things, but you won't actually get to do them yourself. If you want to go and buy yourself a saw and a lathe down the track and do it all yourself, cool. The workshops will be held over a four-week period, um, Saturday mornings. So we're looking at anywhere between three, four hours. So in that time, we'll do a couple of hours working on the drums. There are some processes such as gluing and polishing, which you have to let things dry so we can't finish them in that day. So included in your morning at Rokeby, there'll be drum making. We will have coffee or morning tea. Um, and there'll also be a one hour introductory um, drumming workshop as well. Each morning you'll do an hour of drumming. 
so that by the time you've finished a drum, you'll actually have a vague idea of what to do with it next. After that, if you want to come back and do more lessons with me, great. If you want to find someone else to teach you, great. But it's just to get you on your way because there's nothing worse than making a drum and go, mm, now what do I do with it? The pointy end of the video uh, is about the workshop itself. There have been a number of people who offer and have offered uh, drum making workshops. Generally, these workshops are a matter of going to, along to the thing. You choose a djembe and then you skin a djembe. That's it. So basically, you're only really learning how to skin a drum. With this workshop, you'll learn how to make the drum. You'll learn all facets of the drum making process and the skinning as well. So when you finish this process, you will be able to go away and build your own drum again and again and again. You can start your own business if you like. Just not in Gippsland, though. Go to somewhere else. And the pointier end of the stick is how much is this going to cost? Um, the course is $500. It covers all materials. It covers all maturation. It covers coffee. It covers cake. And it covers drumming tuition for an hour for four weeks. Consider, um, there is a form that you can fill in. I'm not sure where it is, but it's somewhere around here. Or you'll find it. Um, please feel free to fill that in with your $150 and send it to me. And I will confirm with you immediately when we're ready to start. So thank you. Hope to see you soon.